in the name of Allah, the most gracious, most merciful. You can say, you know, eternal. You can say magic. You can say miracle. This is the best point I give to my, you know, whoever they're watching, brothers. And you not keep this message in your heart. You can spread because this is the powerful message Almighty God give to us. Surah Ikhlas. What is that powerful? In this earth, top 10 religion rooming you know you can go circle like you can go you know on and on you can say you know <coughs> they you know walking like you know clock like but the point is all mankind they're not thinking surah class what is that say he's the one god god the eternal the uncaused, cause of all exists. He beget not, neither he begotten. There is nothing that could be compared with him. Almighty God says, Hulhu Allahu Ahad. Allahu Samad. Lam Yalid Walam Yulad Walam Yakulahu Fanahad. This is the Arabic and I, you know, translation uh, in English also. These points, if you understand, you not, you know, think any other religion like. Suppose if I say these points Almighty God give to Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi when he revealed Almighty God Allah via with Gabriel, Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, peace be upon him, Prophet, he memorized and he give to that companions till today. If you go in this earth, till today I'm talking, every single day, there is no God except Allah, Muhammad is the last message, come and pray, you know, get the benefit. So what Almighty God give to you message, say He is the one God. Only this word, if non-believer understand, he not, you know, think other religions. This is challenge going on since 1435 years in this earth. No one came, no one can break. This is challenge go till the judgment day. Mankind not understand because God give to you know his knowledge have powerful 100% suppose Almighty God have. So God give to 1% knowledge for all mankind, demon and shaitan and he's all 80,000 creatures. Only one person he give to. He divide, he spread that his knowledge in one person. So that's why man not understand the powerful, supreme, almighty God. What is that? Hulhu Allahu Ad. How come every single second, every single second going on in this earth? Because we pray Salah every day. And 99%, many Muslim brothers, they reside in the Salah, Namaz. Allah says, if you're not Muslim, okay, you worship whom you believe. This is also going on 24 hours, like all non-believers. But the day judgment day, definitely he asks, do you saw God after this challenge? God is unseen alone in return. Do you saw that? Anybody came front of you like Jesus or Ram or anyone, Buddha, whoever you thinking God like they came after this challenge? Why you not understand? Definitely Almighty God asks you, brother, I give to you three challenges in this video. Only one God. This challenge going on every single second in this. Other one is there is no God except Allah Muhammad is the last mission. This two second challenge, every single second. And Darud, Allahumma salli ala Muhammad. Every single second, we peace be upon him, Muhammad says. My Muslim brothers, they're talking, you know, 
Bible, Jesus not give to that. You know, other one is Jesus not give to Christianity. One more thing, Jesus not buy any church. Big challenge for Christians. They not understand this point. Kul ho Allahad. Another one is Hindus, Ram. If they say wrong, God name is wrong, Ram. Right name is A for Almighty. Or right A for Almighty, wrong, Ram, God name. Or same or. And they believe, suppose if anybody God like, they put statues, that's why they're wrong. They have pagans like, that's why they're wrong. They not imagine because man is a, such a small and this world such a big and God make angel such a big, tallest. They can't imagine. Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam says, I can't see Jibreel. They not understand. Hindu, they not understand. You know, Ramba Urvasi Menaka, they says, they don't know the who means. Brothers, very great. Okay, now, my point. Gandhi came, he gave a peace message that not benefit here after life for Gandhi. Abdul Kalam, he made nuclear. He, he is a hero like for India, but he, his life is not benefit here after life for this cause because he made nuclear. He's a responsible for, you know, people, if they use that nuclear, people die, definitely ask Allah, why you did it? Did I say to spread, you know, blood shed in, in this earth? Definitely he asked, Abdul Kalam. Same thing, atheist one guy, Christopher Hitchin, he always, you know, he's atheist and he always criticized Islam. But when he died, you know, he drunk. When he died, you know, that time he had cancer. For what? His life, eight years, his life is gone, you know, useless like. And he only hurt Muslims, Christians, and other, even uh, Jewish also, he hurt. Why? He, his life, he not understand. Because he not asked, who is my Lord? Gandhi, he didn't ask, you know, Oh Allah, do you create me? Abdul Kalam, he make nuclear. He not ask, Oh Allah, I'm reading Quran and Gita, but I didn't ask you, you know, can I make nuclear? My message, always, you know, to, you know, you can recognize. I want to be remind you, one powerful God, A for Allah Almighty. That's it. Always, I want to be give true message for mankind. This challenge going on, every single second. And there is no God except Allah. Muhammad is the last message. And come and pray and get the benefit every single second. Even the Darud, peace be upon him, Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, powerful man in this earth. No one can give to you these three challenges. Any religion, Allah, 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 Allah.